What's up, gamers? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. London and the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think the port key was meant to lead us there? I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. with every cast. Thank you, sir.
We're close now. It's just ahead. <laughs> Steady yourself! Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That portkey led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! someone have conjured that enchanted stone here and how is there a room behind it what room i don't see anything there's that glow again like the glow on the port key container what in merlin's name godric's heart where are we i don't believe it Hello? Just a moment. <laughs> oh. Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key. White's port key. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. Nah, I'm gonna wander off, boy. After you. How many volts are there? Hundreds. In fact, 
You'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. time this vault was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Thank you for your help. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. Let, uh, let me out of here, you goblin. <laughs> The gambling your nuts. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Closer and try again. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. 
If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lumos. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Rebellion. Not out of Gringotts. I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Rebellion. I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait. When you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm. Perhaps you should cast Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection's turning towards me. It does follow the light. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? Revelio. What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Lumos. Revelio. That's where they're leading me. That glow again. Lumos. 
Lumos. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Revelio. statues with their reflections. Seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Revelio. did you... What is this place? I don't know. But I found this floating above that... basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive... for viewing memories. I wonder... Follow my lead.
All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just... Give me whatever it is you found here, and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they had the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have them. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to.
ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Hogwarts Legacy. Good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Phineas, Nigellus, Black. Prepare yourself to meet the Headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has... Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain... expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm... indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. You belong in Slytherin! And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. 
Enough. It's not as though I've banned flying altogether. Uh. But don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin Common Room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. I suppose some introductions are in order. Can I help you? Oh, thank Professor Fig and I. It was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I'll let I wouldn't do that if I were you. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I did. You should have listened to me. Perhaps. Pres Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. Protego! I, I think I heard one. Ah. I'd much... Thank you, Ominous. Is the new fifth-year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with... Oh? Here you are.
What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what... This way. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. Do keep up! Why don't you cast Revelio? Revelio. And see what details the field guide can provide. Revelio. Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. Revelio. Critago. opportunity to show you how to use blue flames to get around a bit quicker your field guide contains a map of the castle open it up and find central hall And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive, our King's Cross Station, so to speak. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get... Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your... judging... We did... Oh? My... Good luck today. And... It's good to see you, Professor. Did I hear you and Professor? Yes, sir. But... I... 
could. The map is enchanted. Now, sounds like... That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> <sighs> So why don't we have our newest students start us off, hmm? <laughs> Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and release Accio. your charm at the last possible. That's it! Now, excellent! Stay focused! to Slytherin, but there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give up? Come on! You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Here we go! That is 
how it's done. Akio. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Hey, enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go! Good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Thank you, but I... I trans... my... Well, it's been... Ah, I think... Him. Of course, you can oh, well, you if you would, if you're so inclined. Well, and now. Hello there. You're Thank the you. student, aren't you? And then the well handy resource indeed. Oh, your well field guide. Where were you? I'm most pleased. The Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Booth. No, it wasn't. <gasps> oh, what fun! I won't say my goodbyes. I could care for the boy who says you're telling I'm lies. I'm not telling lies, Peeves. It was Albert Booth. No, it wasn't. It was Basil Flat. Oh, fight, fight! It's a bold attack! Off on another adventure, are we?
Revelio. Levioso. Now, let's try something a little larger. Begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprised opponent is a Levioso. Good. Now, well done. Very good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. <laughs> Levioso. Lucky. Nothing lucky about it. I know. This cool. Protego first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Tego. Let me also. Let's see. I'm all the best to be for this day. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> I. All right. That's enough spectacle for one. Nice work. I enjoy. Yep. Then again. I've jeweled enough. Ex Good. Till next time. Glad you can make it. Lucan's just over there. Levioso! Can I help you? Sebastian told me to see you about a club. If Seb I'm flat. Of course. Get me. will make you regret signing up.
Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but check with me later. I may have something lined up for you. Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well fought. Hope to see you back here again. Love you also. Let me go. Let me go. Akio. Let me go. What about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same. I trust your... Have you... Professor? I'm... I'd like... What? <laughs> 